video for you today. I'm excited to make this one. Um, and it is purely because Black Friday has come and gone and I actually have a bit of a haul for you. I either bought a couple of things or I had some vouchers and I made up the difference and bought some things and I bought some really exciting stuff. I am like, I'm so pleased with all of this. So let's have a look what I got. And I'm gonna start with a highlight and that is these beautiful Chloe sunglasses which I had wanted for ages. <laughs> I was upset now. These Chloe sunglasses that I had wanted for ages. Um, I ended up working with Vision Direct, so I did get given this pair. Um, and this was on my Christmas gift guides. Uh, I'm just gonna pop them on. I freaking love these. <laughs> They're so cool. Um, so they are a scalloped edged heart shape pair with gold detail and then there's like a, I don't even know what you call it, like a pale tortoiseshell on the side. Oh, they're so, so well made. They are on sale uh, on Vision Direct. They have them in three different colors and then they are just, oh, they're so beautiful. These are gonna be my summer sunglasses that I wear with everything. I'm so, so excited. The quality is amazing. This is my first Chloe pair of sunglasses, but I feel it won't be my last because there are so many pairs that I love. Um, and yeah, this comes in the heart shape, but it also comes in like a round shape. And then there's a whole bunch of others that have that beautiful scalloped edging as well. And it's just a single piece of glass cut in that detail. Oh, I love them. <laughs> Mm, so so happy and they arrived really really quick I've bought a lot of things over the years from Vision Direct it's where I order my like contact lenses and stuff like that and uh, the range that they have of glasses and sunglasses is <sighs> amazing I they have every they have every brand they have Celine, Tom Ford, uh, Dior, Chloe even smaller brands I love like Chimmy I get so many pairs from Vision Direct and they actually just started stocking Bottega Veneta as well so my Bottega pair are up there um, and they always seem to have deals going and this was just such a good price um, I'm obsessed so that is my new go-to sunglass for summer I have another big designer split <laughs> I think I'd probably almost do an unboxing video of this one um, on its own. Mm. <laughs> but that is the Yachmus. Yachmus? Yachmus? God, I wish I could pronounce that properly. I don't really know. Yachmus? Yachmus? I've heard people say this so many different ways. But this bag I wanted as soon as I saw it. And then when it went on sale, um, on Shop Up, I got it before it was going to sell out. I was thinking that is exactly the kind of bag that's going to sell really fast. And yeah, it's still a designer bag. It's not cheap. It's beautifully made. <sighs> All right, let's just open up and have a look. I'm so, so excited. Um, I have boots from Jacquemus, but I haven't gotten anything else before. So it is this beautiful suede bambino bag there's the back there it's in this grayish taupe sort of suede i'm being very careful with it because i've i've unboxed it but i haven't um sprayed it yet with any protectant spray because i've run out i have to go and grab some more um but yeah, so it comes with a crossbody strap, but you can also take that off and just use this very cute top handle. Um, I just love the detail of this one. The, I'm really into this like stitching. I have a Marc Jacobs suede bag um, that I got a couple of months ago and it, the top stitching is my favorite part of that bag. Um, so it just has a magnetic 
flap part to it. That opens up to pretty generous size there. And it's just got a side pocket inside and then a side pocket on the back there. I'm being so careful because I don't want it to just end up looking super gross because obviously you're being suede and a light colour. Yeah, I mean the colour is going to change and it's going to add have have it's gonna end up with character that's just inevitable if you go for a light suede um but oh it's just so pretty it's just beautiful i really love i love it so much it's very soft not touching it too much but that was my designer bag purchase i love it i'm just gonna pair that with everything once it has been sprayed i'm not going to touch it until I've spray, sprayed it first, which actually I'll have to go and do tomorrow because I want to wear this on a little staycation we're doing this week. Um, I won't tell you where, I'll take you along, um, but it's a place that uh, is one of the best hotels in the world and it's right here and I've never been before. Um, I've, I've been inside some of the rooms when I've gone to events and I've uh, had meals there and stuff, but I haven't stayed before and we are staying for two nights. I'm so excited. Okay, so I will um, probably end up wearing some of these things there because I'm very excited for them. Uh, next up, I had, I love Realization Pa. I'm so excited to have a new um, order. It's actually been a while. I've got a lot of their pieces, but, um, I wear them all the time, first of all, and I love that they're sort of designed to be timeless and to be repeat worn and there's not this whole thing of like, this collection, this season we're doing this, sells out, this collection we're doing this. They have the, basically their full collections have, some of them have been there from the beginning since they launched the brand and they're still just as beautiful and just as popular and the whole idea is not meant to be that you get a certain dress and you wear it like a few times and then it's out of date. The idea is that you just repair, you repeat wear it again and again and again, which I love, I'm really into that. Um, so I got two dresses and I'm obsessed with them. They are very different styles. Uh, yeah. One of them is a very different style to any that I have from Realization Pop. And I was a little bit nervous and I probably could have changed sizes, but let's grab it. So this is this lovely beauty. Uh, I haven't taken the tag off. This is the Alba dress in Dahlia. I ordered it in extra small. I haven't taken off the tags yet because I've tried it on twice. And both times I felt like it was slightly too tight um, across the waist band specifically on me. But I, I feel like it's fine. I'm probably just being particular. Um, I probably could have sized up and I would have found that it was fine for the next size up. Meh. I don't know. It's hard to know and I don't want to send it back and pay for extra postage. So it fits. It's a little snug, but um, that's fine. <laughs> it's, it's like doable. So the print. You can see up close there, the print is just this beautiful print. I love this colour. I thought that it would be a really nice summery print that I can then carry through to autumn, maybe early winter with some layering, wearing it with boots. I haven't got anything this long from them before. It's very long on me, but I love that. Been really into maxi dresses lately. Um, so I'm really happy to add this to my collection. It has an invisible dip, zip. It has an invisible zip down the side and it has some uh, smocked elastic detail at the back there for extra give and then you can um, you can adjust you can adjust the straps and you can also adjust how uh, tight or loose it is across this like milkmaid bust line. So that is maxi dress number one and realization part dress number one. Dress number two. Oh, I love this so much. It is beautiful. 
I just, I can't stop smiling. <laughs> I love it. I love it, love it. I wore it the other night uh, for a quick photo shoot and then to the event that we had at the Republic of Fremantle opening. And I just felt amazing in it. It just is just the cutest dress. You've got this bell sleeve. It's very 70s sort of feeling, deep V uh, fitted bodice. Um, and then like the skater skirt style. It's so damn cool. They're both a crepe silk. Um, this one's got lining through the skirt part, but not really the bust, but I didn't wear a bra with it and it was fine. It's fine on its own. I just love it so much. Um, I wore this one with my boots. You'll see in the other video that I add in there. Um, it looks amazing with boots, but you know when you, if you get something new and straight away, uh, once it gets delivered, you try it on with a bunch of different things. You know that it is like a winner. I tried this one with, I swear, about 12 pairs of shoes and they looked amazing <laughs> with all of them. And then a bunch of different jackets and um, things to layer with. And I just, oh, I am so in love. I'm so happy that I bought this. It was, yeah, during the Black Friday sale. So I did get it on um, sale and I was just... I was so naughty buying those dresses because it's not like I needed them, but oh my god, I'm obsessed. So prepare to see this all the time on me because I love it, love it. Another spring summer dress that arrived is this one from Reformation, which was also an order that I put through with my bag um, on ShopUp. This is linen dress. I love the Reformation linen pieces. I've got a couple of tops and another one or two dresses from, yeah, two linen dresses. Whenever they do the linen ones, I try and buy those because I'm not a big fan of viscose, um, which is what they make a lot of their other dresses out of. I think that they just nail it with their linens. This one has a very cool open back with all these tie up parts. Um, I went with, my normal size from them is usually an extra small, uh, but I think I sized up for this because I've been finding the waistband again has been a little, little bit tight. To be fair, I haven't been exercising as much as I usually do, so maybe I've just been a bit lazy lately. Um, so maybe it's just my waist is, um, I can maybe like a half an inch or an inch bigger than it usually is when I'm in my normal workout routine. Uh, but yeah, I was quite happy to size up to this one. It's a beautiful dress. It is lined, um, so I haven't had any issues with it being white um, and see-through or anything, because obviously I wouldn't wear a bra with this one uh, being open back. I love it. It's going to be another... I have so many white linen dresses now for summer. Um, this one's just a little mini one. It's gonna be so cute. All right, hello, I'm back. Um, as you can see, I have changed outfits. It's a totally new day. We had some battery issues. The battery died. Um, I'm not entirely sure even where I got up to, but I will just wrap up this video and I'm actually going to do another one because I have a mountain of clothes here of more items that I got uh, in Black Friday sales and of late and I think it's better if I do more of well it's going to be a mixture honestly um, so this is rounding up part one and part two is going to have some slightly less designer pieces and more like well there's things from Princess Polly and Lioness and um, brands that are a bit more affordable, but still great quality. So one I think that I was getting up to is this Lindsay Nicholas New York dress, which is a silk maxi black dress in the most beautiful silk. It has pockets. I'm so impressed. And it has this stunning um, detail pleated across the bust line there, which just flows down. It's a very long, flowy dress. Um, that I wore the other week. We tried filming it when we were out 
and it was a little bit windy. Um, but we took some photos, it was a very windy day. Um, but this is just such a beautiful, minimal, sleek, long, it's so long it's on the floor on me. It's a stunning, stunning dress. Uh, they have this one on the Iconic, um, and this was my first one from Lindsay Nicholas. Um, they're now based in Australia. They started out in New York and um, they are now based in Melbourne. So I was really happy to discover this brand. And I think that is just such a stunning, timeless, elegant, slip sort of style dress. Um, and I love that they thought about pockets as well because every woman loves pockets in their dresses. Um, actually, I'm going to grab my boots because... I don't think that I could really squeeze them into the next video. I'm obsessed. Um, I realised that when they did a preview of these, when they were on pre-order on Instagram, I saved every single picture that they posted, either in this black colour or in like a burgundy cherry red. And then now I have them. It's been a couple of months, but oh my goodness, I love them. So these are from Baird, an Australian company, also from Melbourne. I have so many pairs of their shoes and the quality is just incredible. Um, just briefly, I've included them in this video. Baird are one of those companies that they cut out the middleman and don't add huge markups on their um, shoes. So they're more of an affordable price point with that like luxury designer quality. Um, so I'm still going to put this one in the designer category purely because I've already filmed um, some so and I think this kind of matches being a full leather boot all right so this is a full leather boot I love that they have grip on the sole already so I didn't have to go and get that put on which I do with a lot of my leather soled boots normally this has got a mock croc detail at the front and then it's got a more like tightly um, tightly textured croc on the back and that goes all the way down to the heel. They're so sturdy and so comfortable. They have um, a zip that does up down the side here. They've also got elastic um, at the top to add a little bit more of a vent for your um, calves. And I love that it has this like cowboy style notch at the front that was like really that really I love them so much for that. Baird also have the footbeds in the shoes that are like a comfy molded footbed um, and this one also comes in a wider leg option across the um, calf area. I've got it in just the normal version um, which is quite slim and I'll cut to some video there to show how that looks on. Uh, I'm obsessed. I, I've already styled it with so many looks since they've come and I'm going to be wearing them all through autumn and winter again um, when it gets cooler. I am wearing some bed shoes right now as well, some sandals that also came at the same time but I'll add that into the next video because the next one is definitely summery and a little bit lower price point and this video is long enough. So thanks for joining me on this one. Hope that you've enjoyed that roundup and sorry for the abrupt change in between where I lost my battery. Um, I'm sure that you can deal with that. Let's roll on into the next one. Bye. See you soon.